Hello, this is Dr. Blue here. I don't know why I just said that, but okay. <laughs> so, this is a mailbox that uh, Sam and I worked on today. It's basic, I'm going to say about 80 some percent done. Still got to make a flag, uh, handle, and the lock, and then, you know, clean up the welds and stuff. But it's made out of an old up. Uh, uh, air compressor, an old Sears air compressor that would have had the pump and electric motor wheels and stuff on it. And you can see what I did. it did. It overhangs the door. The door is set in, so the door gets trimmed. The outer, or the lip that was actually here, which is a double lip, gets welded into here, so it's countersunk. So that way when the door is shut, the door is inside keeping out the moisture. Now you can see it tape, uh, gets notched in a little bit that's so that the round door has clearance for the up and down. <clears throat> it's very heavy. Having the concave door like that keeps the door from bending as easy. And see I got my flag mount. Grade 8 bolts in here. It's a uh, the way it's designed, it's the flag goes half past center, or a little past center. And like I said, everything's still going to get trimmed and notched and everything. You got your mounting base, your hinges. Um, it started out at about, what did you say, around 11 o'clock this morning, Sam? I think so. And then we got done around 7. Well, we kind of quit. <laughs> So, you can see it's a, it's a decent mailbox. It should uh, be strong enough to withstand baseball bats, uh, heavy slush being forced off by the plow trucks. And like I said, these little things, these will get plugged and stuff. And I'll do a final video later and some photos.